Prince William was a boisterous youngster who would assert his father's princely status in fights, a royal biographer reveals. Prince William, as second in line to the throne after his father Prince Charles, has had to get used to the responsibilities that come as a future king from a very early age. His mother, the late Princess Diana, often commented on the different temperament of Prince William and his brother Prince Harry who was a quieter child. Royal biographer Katie Nichols' 2010 book William and Harry delves into the early lives of the young princes. She writes how, when the young Prince William started nursery school in 1985, Diana had been anxious about William settling in. However, the young prince soon proved popular with his new friends. Nevertheless, Ms. Nichol writes, when it came to playtime, William was already aware of his princely status. She adds that he also left his fellow pupils in no doubt as to who was in charge. The Vanity Fair writer continues, when he got into a scrap, a common event for the boisterous youngster, he would draw his play sword and challenge his opponent, my daddy's a real prince, and my daddy can beat up your daddy, he would shout. Ms. Nicol also reveals how the Prince and Princess of Wales gave their firstborn the nickname Basher Wills for the toddler's rambunctious temperament. The young Prince William's enrollment in a West London nursery in September 1985 had been Diana's decision, as the princess wanted both her sons to mix with with children their own age. Ms. Nicol adds how this had disrupted palace expectations. She writes, the Queen had expected William to be educated at home in keeping with tradition. 